ch 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 Charlie. 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 Charlie, 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 the explorer. Boots and super cool explorer. Gordon, Gordon, no swiping. Gordon, no swiping. Charlie, the explorer. Hi, I'm Charlie. What's your name? How old are you? Wow, that's big! Guess what? It's exploring time! Oh boy, exploring, exploring, exploring! Today we're going to explore the respiratory system from inside the body. Cool, right? The respiratory system allows the body to get the oxygen it needs through respiration or breathing. It's a really important job because without it, your brain wouldn't get oxygen and you'd have a stroke. Uh-oh! Before we start exploring, we have to figure out how to get there. Can you help me out? Can you say map three times? Are you ready? Go, say map. Good job! But there's a place you gotta get. I can get you there, I bet. I'm the map! You tell Charlie the directions to the respiratory system? Okay, here they are. Can you remember this? Mouth, throat, diaphragm, lungs, avioli. Mouth, throat, diaphragm, lungs, avioli. Did you find out the directions? What are they? Good job, let's go. Ew! We're in the first stop of the respiratory system, the mouth. This is the entrance and exit to all the gases that enter and leave the body. Well, there's not too much to see here. Let's keep going down further. Sweet! We're in the upper part of the throat. Hey, look over there! That's the pharynx. The pharynx is the passageway for food and air from the mouth and navel cavity to join together at the larynx. Oh, and look over there. That's the epiglottis. It's another flap of tissue that closes to protect your vocal cords when you're swallowing. Once the air is passed through the pharynx and the epiglottis, it moves past the larynx. The larynx is another flap of tissue that covers the trachea to sort the air from food. Without it, the food would travel down your trachea into your lungs. This would kill us. Uh-oh. This is a very important part of the respiratory system. That's enough here. Let's go down even further. Woohoo! I think we're in the trachea. The trachea is the first part of the lower respiratory system. This is the tube that transfers air from the larynx to the bronchi. Hey, I just noticed something. If we take a closer look at the walls of the trachea, we'll find a coating of cilia and mucus. The job of the coating of cilia and mucus is to scrub away any toxins such as soot from the inside of the trachea and the lungs. They are constantly working to clean the air you breathe as best as they can. This also preserves our respiratory system from depleting so quickly. We've just about seen everything here. Let's keep going. I think we're in the diaphragm. You can see the ribs and all the muscles. The ribs and diaphragm create a suction effect, allowing air in and out of the lungs. It also protects the lungs and other vital organs inside your chest. When the diaphragm and the muscles contract, it pushes the waste gases, such as carbon dioxide, out of the lungs, up the trachea, and out the mouth. So uh, let's take a deeper look into the diaphragm, the lungs. God, it's pretty noisy in here. It sounds like, it sounds like Sean T from the Insanity videos. <laughs> Anyways, uh, yeah, these are the lungs, and um, the air enters the lungs through the bronchi, right over there. Then it's transferred into the bronchioles, which are a lot smaller airways. Then that air gets sent out through the bronchioles to the walls of the inside lungs, where it meets the pulmonary lobe. The pulmonary lobe, right over there, contains alveoles. Alveoles? Alveoles. Yeah, alveoles. They are clumped together like grapes, and they're called alveoli sacs at that point. On every alveoli, there's pores that allow oxygen to be released into the bloodstream. 
Mixed in with these alveoli cells are capillaries. Capillaries look like this. Capillaries exhale carbon dioxide back into the lungs so it can make its way back out of the body where it belongs. Pretty complex stuff. Didn't you think this was cool? Good. So I heard there's only uh, one way out of here, but I don't want to show you the digestive system yet. Aww. Yeah, we crossed through the land and we did lots of stuff and we do it, we did it, we do it, yeah, and we did lots of stuff and we did lots of stuff and we did it, we did it, we did it, yay, yeah, we did it! This was my health project, thanks guys.